What's up guys, thank you for joining me for another Two Minute Tuesday, where I try to unpack a two minute devotional to help you get your week started off right. So let's get started. All right guys, so on Valentine's Day, I took my wife to see a new movie that just came out. It's called The Greatest Showman. Now, if you haven't seen it, it is truly an amazing movie. Uh, actually, I'm teaching through a series with my youth now on the subject, The Greatest Showman, about when Jesus did amazing things you know, for crowds that just awed people. But as I was watching the movie, The Greatest Showman, I couldn't help but notice some similarities, at least in the character in the movie of P.T. Barnum and Jesus, right? And I know that P.T. Barnum, he has kind of a sketchy past. We know actually quite a bit about him and a lot of people don't agree with what he did, but in the movie, I thought it was interesting that he would go to who you would deem as the outcast, who he would, you would deem as the, the weird people, the ones that no one else chose, the no one, no one else wanted anything to do with, that he would actually go to those people and those were the ones that he chose that he kind of called to come with him. And we see the same thing with Jesus, that in the Bible, Jesus, you know, of course, is a Jewish rabbi, yet he doesn't go to, you know, the scholars and, and the most educated and, and the highest up. No, instead, Jesus goes to what we would deem the outcasts. He goes to the fishermen, to the tax collectors, to the prostitutes. He goes to the ones that no one else wants anything to do with, and he goes and he calls them. You see, I think we can have encouragement in that because Jesus doesn't just come for the perfect. He doesn't just come for the ones who have it all together. Instead, Jesus comes for guys and girls like you and me, us that are, we're messed up, we're a little weird, we're a little off, we're the outcasts. We don't have it all together. We are broken and mangled. It's okay because Jesus came for people like you. Regardless of where you are, what you've been through, or what you've done, or what temptations you've felt, what sins you've committed, Jesus came for you you and you are not outside of his love jesus didn't come for the perfect you don't have to get your life all together you don't have to live that perfect christian life and memorize the entire bible before you can come to jesus jesus came for you right where you are doesn't mean he ain't going to change you but he wants you right where you are I hope that encourages you. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, guys, I release Two Minute Tuesdays every single Tuesday. I also release a normal, uh, longer devotion every single Friday. So be sure to subscribe to my channel. Leave me a comment down below. Let me know if this spoke to you, if you've seen the movie The Greatest Showman, and what you thought. All right, guys, keep living that bold life.